Okay, hi guys, uh, this is uh, a rules for the Grip Tour event at Leeds at the Rowles Gym. Uh, just quick uh, info on this is the norm for all grip comps. Four attempts on each event, there's four events. Uh, rising bar on the max lifts, there's um, two of them, and decreasing weights on the holds. So you go for your heaviest, but then if you fail that, you can go lighter. Um, no wrist wraps, as is always, not allowed, and uh, only the chalk is allowed on your hands. Uh, first event uh, is the one that we had uh, last year at Rowell's Gym. It's the adjustable thick bar. You should come here, Elizabeth. Uh, show three different, three different widths, so you can go thinner. Uh, you can choose whichever one you want. If you go too thin, it will feel baggy. If you go too thick, it will feel not too thick. Um, you grasp it like that, you'll see the fin, you can't get your thumb and fingers around, you'll lift, that touches that and you're There's no down signal, so basically it's this, and down. That's a successful lift. If, if you drop it or anything else, then it's a failure. Basically that is a 10 inch lift. Um, once again, we had this last year, um, but we had a hold with the thumbless axle lift. This year we're going to have a lift and to stop, we've discussed this this year, to, to stop sloppy lockouts and hitching or anything like that, we're having the lift to a certain height, which is 20 inches. That will enable it to be a full grip event. Um, obviously, you know, you're not deadlifted. So the height, there'll be a height gauge there at 20 inches and you will lift it to touch and back down simple as that. Obviously you'll probably do a bit more weight than you go than if you did a full deadlift but it's about testing your grip here not your deadlifting ability and um, this will just make it a lot lot easier for us all to referee and instead of the sloppy catch ones here. So that's to a 20 inch lift thumbless axle. Uh, this is the one hand lift is uh, used to be in competitions in the 1990s in the 2000s and they still run an event in Finland as well but it's a one inch handle you come a bit closer isn't it you can see uh, loading pin is an upright one here um, which will be used for the hold but basically what you're looking at is a top 24 inch height you can use wooden blocks if you're short but what we're looking at um, is you lift and you can't touch anything can't touch your legs, your, your hands can't touch your legs, uh, your, your forearm or anything. So you're lifting it and holding it. It's as simple as that. It really is that simple. No hook grip, obviously. This is a test of grip strength. Um, as with all the holds, it's a minimum five seconds to get a, a good lift. It's four seconds. You can go again, but sometimes it's worth maybe starting to go down the weight. And there's selected weight. And we'll probably be thinking that the top one is going to be 200 kilo, and then we'll tell you those as we've adjusted them. Um, and the final one, um, I know some of the guys at Rowles have been training at the two hands pinch. Um, it's, it is this uh, the weights go either 100 kilo, 85, 70, 55, 40, or 25. And it is this simple grasp the top and an overhand grip. But no wider than three inches between your index fingers and hold it away from your body, not touching anything. On all these hold events, it's worth having your legs wide. Make it easy for me to referee it. Uh, as, as with last year, uh, new guys, strong guys, but new guys to grip coming in. I'll give you as much assistance and help as I want. Uh, but on the, on the platform, I'm firm but fair. And uh, we'll fail a lift if it's not correct. I think that is it. Um, I'll get this one up now. And uh, the one hand lift handles will be in the shop probably in the next couple of weeks. And uh, so that's, that's a great event. It's good to see that back. Okay, see you all there.